Hello. Hey, Bo. What up, peeps? So, um, I got to work really early. So, I was wanting to film a video for you guys. This is going to be like a compare, you know, one versus another. It's two products, the same thing, two mascaras from the same line, NYC. They're both supposed to give you volume, but um, I couldn't choose when I was at the store. And I was like, you know what, let me just go ahead and get two. And I thought it would be cool to do one on each side. So, on my left side, I'm going to be going in with the... Um, New York color volume mascara eight times fuller so that's a lot eight times fuller it's an extreme black noir intense it says showtime so what the packaging looks like hopefully I'm in a frame I hope I'm in frame let's see Am I in frame okay yeah I'm in frame okay and then the second one I have here is called all-in-one mascara volume curl length volume oh wait I don't know why I said volume again but get it all so it doesn't say how much more volume but it says volume so I guess the main thing we're gonna see is if this gives you more volume than this one because this one says eight times more so this one's the Get It All, all-in-one mascara. La, 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 la. So I'm gonna go ahead and open these. So we're gonna put Get It All on the right side and we're gonna put Showtime and on the left side. So Showtime, Get It All. Now I just gotta open these. So this is what Showtime looks like outside of the package. This is what it looks like. Okay, okay. And then this is what Get It All looks like. So the packaging's different. I really like it though. I mean, for NYC, both of these mascaras were like $3.90 something for roughly, um, let's, let's say roughly, um, four dollars I don't know why I lost my mind I sometimes I can't really multitask so this is what the wand looks like for get it all it's pretty big I like it I like the way it looks and then let's see what the wand looks like for showtime I'm surprised I'm remembering these names so oh did I show you yeah I did right showtime looks like this I kind of like the get it all wand better, but we're going to find out. So let's do Showtime first. Let's see. Okay, so I had to add a voice in, I mean a voiceover on this part because I realized throughout when I was editing, I couldn't really put into words how to describe this mascara. So we're putting Showtime on, right? And at first, you know, I was like, oh, okay, you know, it's giving me some links, giving me some link to my eyelashes. But it was just like, it's not much volume at all. Like, it's just mascara. Like, it's just basic mascara. I wouldn't even call it a volume. I wouldn't even put volume in the title because it doesn't grab your eyelashes. It just goes over them like oh let me just pat you on the back or let me just rub my hand down the side of your face I mean or like it's like if you brushed your hair with the other side of the brush not the side with the bristles but the other side that's how it was that's how that's the best way I can put this into words of how this mascara felt when I was putting it on because it just felt like it wasn't right like yeah you can tell I have mascara on of course but what I was looking for eight times the volume that's a lot that's that's making a statement and that statement was not correct because I just did not I was not feeling that mascara at all um I don't like the wand um I feel like it's just false advertisement, <laughs> to be honest. I really do. 
because it just it didn't give me so much volume I was really confused when I was putting it on but yeah that's the best way I can explain it is it's like brushing your hair with the wrong side of the brush it's not doing anything let's see <laughs> all right bye guys off the back the main difference already is that this one actually lifts and picks up my eyelashes like I feel like it's really doing something like I can tell it gets a grip a hold of my eyelashes the other one I just feel like it was just going across it but it really wasn't gripping my eyelashes like this one is so far I think I like this one better yeah it just looks nicer and I'm gonna do a third coat. I really like this one. I'm gonna ask her which side looks better. Okay, I did end up making a mess. Okay, this is gonna be the test. We're gonna ask her which side looks better. <laughs> I was like, I'm just having to put my energy in a dinner this morning. Okay, okay, I see. I was like, Raquel, man. <laughs> I, like, I, I like it. I wonder if she even gonna know. Huh? I said, I wonder if she even gonna know. Yeah, it's different. I mean, yeah. I I'm know. used to it being curly. Oh, I, know. I like it. Okay, I'm doing um, a test. I'm recording it for my YouTube channel. Which side looks better? Which eyelashes look better? Which eyelashes? And I know I made a mess on my eyelid, but which, yeah, which side? The left side or the right side? Uh, one. I'm gonna go that one. The right side? Yeah. I think this one looks better too. Okay. That's funny. I'm about to go up there. <laughs> I was like, let me pick one. <laughs> I mean, but, yeah. Do they look the same though? Um, Can you tell a difference? I think this one just looks more clean. Clean? Not as, like, it's not clumpy. Clump. Yeah. Okay. Yep, that's what I was saying. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. So, so far, and we just got secondhand witness that Get It All is like more clean, more precise. It like really lifts my eyelashes. Um, this one does kind of clump it up. It's not very even, but like I said, it doesn't grab the eyelashes. It's just going over them like... So wherever, I don't know how to explain it, but this one, I really like this one so far. I'm going to try to clean my eyelids in a minute. I'm going to put a fourth coat. <laughs> but yeah, I think this one gives it volume and length at the same time because like I said, it grabs onto your eyelashes unlike the other one. And that's what I want. I want it to be even. I want it to look even. I want my eyelashes to look bomb. Um, and I'm really glad I did this video. And I'm glad I bought these two. Because if you're looking for a new mascara, cheap. I mean, that one's really good. And we'll see how this third cut goes. I just feel like it's not even... It doesn't even make a difference. Let me try to see what happens if I, even though it already has mascara on it. Let's see if I go in with, see, it still grabs it. Cause I was just about to say, oh, maybe it's because, you know, it's dried up now. But nope, even though it's dry, this um, mascara still grabs the eyelashes. It just makes a big difference. But yeah, now you can really tell this one's more clumpy than the other side. Okay. Man, you see how long those made my bottom lashes? God. This mascara is freaking awesome. And it, like I said, it was only like three something at Walmart. 
Get it all, girl. Get it all. Okay. I'm going to let this dry and then I'm going to clean up my eyelashes. But, man. Yeah, this one, this get it all one is the bomb. I don't even think I'm ever going to use this um, Showtime one. I love this mascara already. I love you. Mm. Okay. So this is what the outcome looks like. I hope I'm still in frame. Okay. So if you can see. I ended up putting get, get it all on both of them. But I hope throughout the video you could tell how much of a difference it really did make. Get it all and how mm, the Showtime was. I really did not. I wasn't feeling the Showtime one at all. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Um, please like, comment, share, talk to us. We like talking to you guys. And we'll see you in our next video. I know I need to cut my nails. You don't have to tell me. Okay? Okay. Bye, guys.